Hi boys and girls, it's Mrs. Schulte. Today we are going to make Tacky the Penguin. He's that crazy bird who has a whole bunch of books written about him. So we're going to start out with our pencil drawing tool. I like to click black to use as an outline. And let's click the oval shape. What you do is you push down the left side of your mouse and hold it down. Pull and stretch, and you can have make it whatever shape you want to. I'm going for kind of a chubby egg. All right, and then I'm going to give my tacky some nice big eyes. And inside those eyes, I like to add the pupils. You can do that however you would like to. I don't like that one, so I'm going to go click my undo guy and try again. Well, there we go. Now there's a straight line tool down there. Take that tool and I'm going to draw a straight line right from one eye to the other. Then I'm going to come down at the left and make a V. Come down from the right and make a V. And that makes his, vet, his uh, beak. Then I'm going to make his vest. Let's start on the left side and draw a line down at an angle. And do the same thing from the right side. Kind of makes the letter V, which <clears throat> is what vest starts with. And we're making a vest. Then let's make a line straight across the bottom to complete his vest. I'm going to give him a big old circle for a button right in the middle. Now he doesn't look like much of a penguin right now, does he? Let's use that squiggly line tool and draw him some wings so he doesn't look like an Easter egg. Your wings can be whatever shape you want. Penguins don't have very large wings, but they're just kind of off to the side of their body. There we go, and let's give him some feet. The feet, I just draw a straight line out, and then I draw a little zigzag and a straight line back to the body. Straight line out, zigzag, 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 and straight back to their body. All right, the thing that's going to make this penguin look really awesome and make him look tacky is when we paint his clothing. Let's go to the paint bucket, and I think... Well, before I do his clothing, I'm going to start with his beak. So let's color in his beak, and I'd like to also color in his feet the same color. Now for his body, instead of using black, I'm going to use a dark gray. That way we'll still be able to see his eyes. Makes it a little bit easier that way. Now for his eyes, go back to black, color those eyes in. Okay, now we get to do the fun part. That's his clothes. I'm going to pick up purple color and click on the paint bucket that has the designs in it. Let's see if we can look at some, oh, I see some already. I see some clothes that definitely look like something that Tacky would love to wear. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Let's see if we can find something else. Let's look in the green category. Is there anything there that Tacky the Penguin would like to wear? Oh, I see another one that looks good. He, he, the crazier the better for Mr. Tacky. Okay, now let's just do his button in the middle. There we go. Now, Tacky's not complete until we give him a background. Since he's in a cold climate, and there's probably a lot of blue sky, I'm going to choose a blue background. Let's see. I'm going to go with regular blue. Click through those and see if there's one that you really like. I think, I think these suns are kind of cool. All right, let's give it a try. Okay, now, I love that background, but let's say you didn't. Don't forget, you can use the little undo guy. Click his face, and you could pick a different background if you wanted to. Okay, oh, don't like that one either. Go ahead, and I'm going to go back to the one I picked at first. And there you have it, Tacky the Penguin and Kid Picks. How many of you think you can do this? Well, I'll bet you can. Have a fun time trying. 